dark. We're also going to take some of the same color and we're going to push it into the eyes. And this is a unifying, uh, a unifying move here. Very careful around the eyes, but a little bit goes a long way. love those very expressive eyes. I also want to put just a little bit of life in the nose, so we're going to add a little bit on there. We might even put a few notes down here in the collar area, around the mouth. Okay. Okay, now I'm going to work on my nose area here. And we're going to soften. Soften this area. We're going to kind of work around the nose now for a little bit. very important part of a dog portrait is this nose. You want it to be, uh, you want it to uh, sort of protrude, you know, you want it to come forward. And so I'm going to show you how I do that, how I make that happen in just a minute. Sometimes it's good to just use your finger do some interesting softening with your finger it's kind of hard to do sometimes with a brush so we're going to dirty up this part of his face a little bit and we want to soften this area up no hard lines in here Okay, I'm getting pretty happy with the nose. It does need a little work in there, and then just use the finger. There we go. Um, okay, getting getting pretty happy with that. Now let's just bring the some of that color up, up there a little bit. Okay, good. Okay, and then we're going to 
nice soften. I'm gonna bring the eyes out a little bit more with a little bit darker liner right there. Exactly what I wanted. And I just need a little connection there. There we go. You can see how much work I'm putting into this dog's eyes, and it's because it's so important to the overall finish. Okay, we're back, and we're going to continue working on our buddy here. Um, I'm getting pretty happy with this. I don't like to overwork a painting once I have a real good likeness, which I think we do. Um, there are a few things that I do like to do to finish them off. Um, there are a few areas too on here that we're going to soften. Um, and first of all, though, let me t show you how to bring that nose out. Bringing the nose out is really about adding a warm color in the nose area somewhere. Sometimes I'll see a bit of red in the nose. And so just those little bits of, of red in there will help to bring that nose forward. Also those highlights, obviously, we're going to soften this highlight right here a little bit. Okay. I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, so also this one here. There we go. 